Welcome back to the Freak Show. Make me into a vampire. <laughs> Welcome back to the Mosh Pit. Can I get a hell yeah? Hey guys, so today I wanted to do... Okay, backtrack. I... Okay, stay here. I bought things on Etsy, as I do. I bought Harry Styles tattoos. Um, I'm very... Like, I don't think you understand. I am very excited. So today I was gonna do a lookbook inspired by Harry Styles moment. I have a lot of his outfits because um, I've recreated them because I obsess over people that I like. I don't know, I just have this whole vision in my head of like, if Harry Styles was a woman. And... <laughs> because a lot of girls in the fandom are very inspired by his style. A lot of men are too, but um, it's very easy to recreate as a girl. So let's do that. Um, I've just done my 60s makeup. Um, I uploaded I uploaded a tutorial on how to do this. So if you wanna see it, please go watch it. Please, I'm missing a thing. <laughs> it's 3 a.m. Um, so let's put some tattoos on me. Hey everyone, a quick word from our sponsor, Raycon. So I've been using these earbuds for my 3 a.m. call time choreography sessions during this quarantine. They stay put so well. The sound is just as great as any other top audio brand. Oh, ground jam and hey. They start at like half the price of any other um, premium wireless earbuds on the market. This new model, the Everyday E25, has six hours of playtime. Wireless charging case, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, cool colors, you get the gist. And I actually have a 15% off deal for you guys at buyraycon.com slash Britney Broski. <laughs> okay, anyway, uh, back to the video. I haven't put on fake tattoos since I was like, I'm lying, I definitely did this like a year ago. Your tattoo will stay on for up to seven days. Okay, I need to look up like a reference picture of- okay, well I know where the majority of these are on him. I know this chip is right here. I know the heart and the nails are like on his thing. I know that this one is on the back of his like right here. This is creepy. I know the bird cage is right here. I know the anchor is right here. I know the birds are right here and I know the moth is right here. Okay, let me think about this, because this is a lot. Seven days is a lot, and he has a lot of tattoos. I'm just not realizing, oh my God. And the stories, the stories. We don't know the stories behind a lot of them, but oh my God, I'm sure they're great. I'm gonna go like map this out and I'll throw up a reference picture. So anyone who's not a fan of Harry Styles knows what I'm talking about, and I'll be back. Okay, so I'm gonna just do it by so anyway, I'm just gonna- I'm just doing it by like location on his arm. I'm obviously not gonna do the ones on his chest and stomach because I hate my body. So we're gonna do the ones on his arm and then going down the arm. So let's go ahead and get some things cleared up. What's my favorite Harry Styles song? Canyon Moon. Next stupid question. Canyon Moon and Sunflower Volume 6 are those bitches. They're those bitches and I'm sick and tired of the hate of the lack of attention. They're so good. I'm also, listen, I love a good sad Harry song, like Meet Me in the Hallway and From the Dining Table, like Have I Cried to Them? Yeah. But listen, I love a happy Harry song because he's so happy and he makes me happy. So why would I, why would I not combine them and make a beautiful child together? I am gonna look so good, I think, maybe. Oh my god, Maddie Healy's gotten so many more tattoos since the last time I stand in the 1975. I stand in the 1975 in the golden days, when it was 1975, Arctic Monkeys, The Neighborhood, like, yes, I had a Tumblr. Those were the days. The days to be a stan. I think a lot of their later work is fantastic, but I'm just... I'm not as in it as I used to be. Oh my god, I'm so excited to share this moment with my fellow hairy girls. I'm so excited, this is so... And I can, if I mess this up, I can just buy it again. You know what I mean? Ow, bitch, I just cut myself. <laughs> Owie, didn't feel too good. This heart tattoo is so ugly. Harry, I love you, but what the hell? What are you doing, babe? Like, I literally don't like it. I feel like a lot of his tattoos are just like, yeah, go ahead, tattoo me. Oh my god, we should also note that the only tattoo I have is a hairy tattoo. I feel like I'm doing crafts. What even is that? What even is that? 
Harry, these are about ugly as shit. I'll tell you what. This kind of looks like a little dookie. <laughs> kind of looks like a little dookie. Focus. Focus, please. Please, God. <laughs> like, I'm trying. I'm trying so hard. He has that big eagle tattoo, doesn't he, now? Did he get it covered up? Oh, that's T. He got it covered up with the eagle. I'm so good. I'm so... <laughs> Okay, so I just got done cutting <laughs> all of them out, all the ones that I want to put on, and I have never felt more like a socio-psychopath in my entire life. I just spent 20 minutes looking at all the tattoos on this man's body perfectly. Look at this. Look at this and tell me a psycho wouldn't do this. What is this? I laid them all out, how they are on his body. This all on his arm. So what I found out is he has only tattoos on his left arm. That's not even true. So as I was saying, the majority of his tattoos are on his left arm. And he has the big eagle one right here and then some other shit, but it's mainly that. And then the ones on his chest, I'm not doing that. Okay, so let's get started. I feel so mentally ill. I feel so mentally ill. And then I'm gonna dress like him after this. I'm going to jail. I'm gonna go get a wet washcloth, I'll be right back. Okay, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of me not planning things out at all. I guess I'm gonna just attach these on my arm how I how I think they should be. Me like, how am I gonna perfectly recreate his tattoos on my body? <laughs> okay, here's the reference picture. Let's start with the ship since everything will be centered around that. Okay, so it's just kind of smack dab. I'm using y'all as my mirror. Oh, I didn't even take the plastic off. Oh my God. It's like I was never 13. I hate this. Okay, let's do all these. Ready, go. I didn't think this through. I'm like so excited actually. Oh my God, it just hit me. I love tattoos. <laughs> I love tattoos. Let's test them. <gasps> oh, I didn't do it for 30 seconds. Oh my God. Is that wet enough? Okay, great. Ooh, it's kind of slimy. Okay, let's do the ship. Let's do all these girls. Without a doubt, this is one of the most obsessive, psychotic things I've ever done in my entire life. I've been hanging out with Emmy too much. Do you ever hang out with one of your best friends and then you're like, oh my God, I'm becoming them? This is sick. I sound like a middle school boy. <laughs> these tattoos are sick. This is the happiest I've been in weeks. Stay. Okay, next we're gonna do the missing one, the New York, London. LA. Oh my god. This is so embarrassing. Harry Styles, I'm so sorry. Work. Okay, next round on. I think the thing about tattoos is I have so many friends who are just like, oh that's sick, like I'll get it. But with me, tattoos are like, oh my god, I'm gonna be so ugly when I'm 80. But also, I hope I never make it to 80. If I'm 80 years old, shoot me in the head. You know what I mean? What a miserable existence. Like, it's just pain. Like, I'm already in pain now. You know what I mean? My knees hurt. I watch my grandparents just waddle around in pain, and I'm like, God. All right, let's see. Beautiful. 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 <laughs> and beautiful. This is so much fun. I'm having so much fun. I wish I could dub uh, Harry Styles music over it. I don't want this video to just be about Harry Styles. That's so, well, when you come to my channel, do you expect anything other than just brain rot? Brain rot. Yes, we can. I look like that girl who eats with Nikocado avocado and scares the shit out of him. Don't die on me. Oh, I love. Wait, why do I kind of live for this? Am I gonna get 107 tattoos? I'm such a sissy baby. I never, I could never, ever, ever my life. So he's got the corner of this. He's got Mr. Skellington. Or don't focus at all, just never focus, that's fine. And then the handshake there. And then silver spoon. I bet this bitch hurt. I'm gonna need a bigger washcloth. Do y'all call these wash rags or washcloths? Okay, here we go. <sighs> <sighs> bitch, this is so much fun. I'm so good at this. I like left the perfect amount of space. These are already kind of starting to crackle because I move too much. Whatever, life is short then you die. And I live by that. Now there's one right on his, his elbow crack, his krelbo. And the minute I put that on, it's literally gonna, it's gonna crackle like a ding dong. 
What am I even saying? Like when I speak, what comes out of my mouth? The voice in my head does not sound like how my voice sounds. Let me just tell you that much. This is the most fun I've had in days. I kind of like you booze you lose. I'm kind of, I'm not gonna lie, I'm living for this moment back here. Harry. Harry. Okay. The way that I just like, I need it. I think it came out other than this one. I kind of, I kind of butchered it. Let's put on a Harry Styles fit. See you in a second. Okay, here's fit number one. I'm gonna throw up the two that I kind of combined to make this. So we've got the wide leg pants, the Harry boots. Bring it to the runway, runway. I've never felt, I've never felt happier. That's a lie, but uh, this is pretty happy. Okay, next. Also, this was sent to me by a beautiful Harry who runs, I think it's called Pressed Paper Shop. And then these pants are from the wonderful Laura Burns who has dressed me to the nines. Next, Met Gala. Right? Maybe? Don't look at my bed. Seriously, guys. Met Gala. Long, black. I feel like an idiot. With the boots. Harry boots. Oompa loompa. This little bow moment. Everything. Next. Wasn't didn't it wasn't it Gucci? This is from Unique Vintage. This is from Unique Vintage. Again, Laura Burns. Zip up in the back. And then these are from JC Penny. I don't know. I'm white, wherever white people shop. Okay, this one's like not inspired by anything, but I feel like he puts any sweater under like a collared shirt. By the way, <laughs> yeah. And he makes it look sickening. I mean, I just kind of like bunched this up and like tucked it. But I mean, it's still a look with the hairy boots. He always stands like this. Why does he stand like this? Right? Okay. Next. I got this from Walmart, by the way. Okay, this is the last one because I'm like really over this now. This is like the lights up video. Um, these are from Unique Vintage. They have pockets. They are suspenders. I feel like a sexy old man. I'm sweating. Um, in conclusion, I love Harry Styles. And literally in my day-to-day, -day, like, just what I wear in real life is very much inspired by him. I wear those wide leg pants with usually just like a Rolling Stone shirt or like a band tee, which is frustrating because I do a lot of stuff where I film and I can't wear logos or anything and that's like all I own. Let me show you this bag I got really quick. Speaking of brands I can't show off. Isn't this adorable? I got it from Unique Vintage. Okay, anyway, love you guys. Bye. Hi, me again. I thought I was done, but I'm not. I just wanted to point out how ludicrous it is that I just spent literally over an hour doing all this. I just wanted to point that out. Okay, bye.